Well, Frank, if these companies combine, it's going to create shockwaves in the automotive field. It's just a waiting game to see if this merge is really going to happen. If it does, the merged company would make nearly 9 million vehicles a year. That means it would surpass General Motors as the third largest automotive company just behind Volkswagen and Toyota. Renault is studying the proposal with interest and also studying this merge. Michigan automotive experts. We spoke with Tim Nash with Northwood University on what this deal could mean for Michigan. We're going to see more competition for all of the uh, U.S. automobile producers in the sense that uh, Renault, which does not sell very well in the United States at all, would now have the Chrysler channel to be able to sell uh, vehicles. So it should benefit Detroit in the, in the sense that Chrysler and Fiat will now have Renault's technology, and that could bring jobs to the state of Michigan in terms of uh, the safety products, electronic automobiles, and autonomous production. The merger could save more than $5 billion for the two companies each year, according to Fiat Chrysler. There's no timeline for when this merger could take place. Live in studio, Scott Walchek, WNEM TV5.